Okay, I definitely wasn't planning on having my hair like this today, but we're gonna just go with it. Is this outfit cute? I just kind of threw it on. Is my hair cute? <laughs> I kind of feel like I look like a child. Okay, so I have keep getting comments on my Instagram saying like, oh my gosh, Marissa, your skin looks so good. What kind of skincare products do you do you use? I really like your skin. And you know, my skin has not always looked this good. Now, I definitely have never had like horrible skin. Um, my skin has been fairly nice, but I have in the past struggled with textured skin, mainly just on my cheek area. Now, probably back in April, I think is when I really started getting into skincare. Before then, I really didn't do much with my skin, which I know is so bad. But again, like the only thing that I struggled with was the texture of my skin. And for the longest time, I have always been told like the texture in my skin would just go away. Like family members have told me that. So I was like, well, there's nothing like I can do about it. So I just, I didn't really do much with my skincare. So a coworker of mine told me that, that like the main thing that's gonna help get rid of my textured skin is like amping up my skincare. And I was like, what? Like literally this whole entire time I've been thinking, oh, it's gonna go away when I'm like in my mid twenties or whatever. But no, like I just had to like really start getting into skincare for this to go away. And I wanted to make this video to help anyone that is maybe like just getting into skincare and and has textured skin but doesn't really know what to start using i definitely struggled with not knowing like what skincare products i should be using now my skin is more on the normal to dry side so what i have found to help with my textured skin is to find products that are a lot more moisturizing because moisture like getting rid of textured skin at least for me like moisturizing has been like my number one thing so i have a couple of products here in front of me i'm going to tell you what each product claims are you know how they might work on my skin may be completely different for someone else they may benefit like someone may benefit more um, from this product than even I do so I do want to state like their claims but also tell you how they work for me so the first product that I'm going to talk about is the Kate Somerville exfoliate exfoliator now a huge 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 thing for textured skin that you need to do is exfoliate. You really need to get rid of those dead skin cells and it's like that has been a huge thing for me and I think has been why my textured skin has gotten so much better is because I exfoliate a lot more often. So the claims for this product is that it's supposed to reduce appearance of skin roughness, improve the appearance of skin texture, make your skin more supple, softened and smooth the skin, and this is ideal for all skin types except sensitive skin. Now this is the intensive exfoliating treatment. I believe that she has an exfoliator for more sensitive skin. So I would check that out. I don't know what the name of this is, but if you go in, I got this at Sephora, go into Sephora, get a sample of this. Now this is a little bit more on the expensive side. This little teeny thing is $24, but you only need a little teeny like pea size, like a little like that big, that big, that big size um, of this for your whole entire face. I like to exfoliate after I have cleansed my face. Uh, the only like thing that I'm not really a fan of is the smell of it. <laughs> okay, this is going to be so weird, but this kind of smells like, you know, those like, I don't know, what were they called? Like they don't really have them anymore, but there were those smelly markers and it kind of smells like the black one that it kind of smells like black licorice. That's kind of what this smells like, but like you only have to endure it for like two minutes. Like the, 
yeah, two minutes. And then you wash it off and the scent does go away. Uh, but that's like my only problem with it is the scent, but like that's not a big deal. The next product that I'm gonna talk about, Skin Food Black Sugar Wash Off Mask. Now, I just recently started using this mask, but I wish I had it like months ago because I feel like uh, this is this is a good exfoliator. Okay, the claims for this product is black sugar is enriched with vitamins and minerals to hydrate and nourish the skin suitable for all skin types and promotes smooth glowing skin and i think all these claims are correct i love using this product if i'm going to be wearing makeup the next day now i don't necessarily like to wear makeup every single day i like to give my skin a bit of a break but i noticed that when i use this the night before my makeup goes on so smooth and it just my skin looks so nice because it definitely i can see how it has that what is it it really does hydrate and nourish the skin i definitely see that um it looks like that kind of it also smells really good. Now, I I don't know if I've never just like smelled black sugar, but I feel like this smells like citrusy. I don't know. And also, um, I got this at Ulta. You can get it off of Amazon. I'll try and list links for everything down below. And I think this was only like $11. This has 100 grams in it. Like this will last you a while. Like you do not need a whole lot of this between both of these products like i love both of them um you know this is more on the expensive side but i think it is worth your money but if you are trying to save you know your your coin <laughs> then i would definitely go with the skin food one next product is the neogen bio peel gauze peels now i am literally out <laughs> Like, I, oh, I love, love this product. This product is so good. This is such a good product. Buy it, buy it, buy it. I feel like that's just me. This whole entire video is like, just buy it. Like, it, it's good for your skin. Just buy it. <laughs> but the claims for this one is, oh, I forgot to say, the, this is the wine um, scent. They have three different scents. They have wine green tea and lemon and they all do have like different benefits to them so this one is wine serum helps remove dead skin cells cleanse and purify the skin delivers firmer healthier <laughs> delivers firmer healthier and stronger skin and improves skin texture this is another product that i think has helped so much with my skin texture um i kind of wanted to include this with more of the like exfoliators i wish i had more so that i could actually show you um the pads but one side has a more like exfoliating textured side and the other side um has a smooth side and what you do is you use the textured side first rub it all over your skin massage massage and then you after that you use the smooth side and wipe it off and then you wash it off with warm water i really think this has helped my skin like so 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 much and these smell so good i think they kind of smell like sparkling grape juice because <laughs> like because it is like the wine scent but it doesn't have that like alcohol scent to it but yeah, I love these. And these do come with 30 pads. And I'd say this lasted me a good like two months. Cause I would use these like twice a week. You definitely don't need to be using them like every single day, especially cause they are, I think around like 24, $25. So I didn't want to be using them every single day, but they are really good thumbs up from me <laughs> next i'm going to be talking about the causer x snail essence 
I like to use this essence after my toner. The the snail mucin mucin mucus mucus snail stuff. So it helps with dry patches, get getting rid of acne breakouts, and also helps with hyperpigmentation. And this is also great for all skin types. I am out of this, so I definitely liked it. Oop, there's a the sticker. This product is so weird. So ah, uh, I wish I had like ah, uh, darn. I wish I had a little bit more so I could show you because. When it comes out, it looks super watery, but then when you like touch it, it's like super stringy, but it feels super moisturizing and hydrating to the skin. And it really like sits in very well into my skin. Like it didn't feel, it doesn't leave your skin feeling like sticky or anything. It definitely um, absorbs into the skin very well, which is good because I really don't like any products that like sit on top of my skin i feel like it just it feels gross and i feel like it's not really helping my skin as much if it just kind of sits on top so i really like this product next product is another oh this product this is okay this and like the neogen uh pads are like I feel like my holy grail products at the moment. Like these have helped my skin immensely. This is the Claire's Freshly Juiced Vitamin Drops. Now this is a serum. Vitamin C is super, super good if you have textured skin. That's what I have discovered. Oh, I have an itch, sorry. <laughs> so this product is supposed to help fade brown spots, protect the skin from pigmentation keep the skin firm and reduce visible fine lines, brighten and even out the skin tone, and is good for all skin types. Now I definitely don't know about like the fine lines because I don't really have any yet, but it definitely has helped brighten and even out my skin tone. My skin just glows after I apply this. Now I do use this at night because it does take a little bit more time to like absorb into my skin, but it does. I, I just want to say that because I know I was saying how I don't like when like things sit on top of my skin and don't absorb, but this does absorb. It just it does take a little bit more time. That's why I like to use it at night. If you are going to plan on using it during the day, great serum. I feel like everyone has talked about this serum. I was like, is it really that good? Because again, it's kind of on the pricier side, but this has lasted me months. Maybe because I only use it at night, it has lasted me, but... <sighs> get it. Please. Please get it. <laughs> the last product that I'm going to be talking about is the Innisfree Orchid Enriched Cream. Now, this definitely, I think, is going to be more beneficial for someone with dry skin but this is supposed to firm the skin it reduces wrinkles and improves the skin tone for healthy and radiant glow this is again another product that I really like to use at night because you have to give it a little bit more time to sink into the skin depending on how much you use but I love this product i obviously love all these products that i'm talking about i would not recommend it to you guys if i didn't like it but this product has been so good so good when i put it on it literally like smooths out my whole entire face my face feels so nice oh it's so good it's a really good moisturizer what I have found to be the most helpful for my skin and getting rid of the texture is moisturizing. And this is definitely a very moisturizing product. It also smells really, really good. It has a very light floral scent. Like it's very light. Um, so if you are sensitive to smells, I think you'll be okay with this because it's not like too powerful, but there is still like a little, a little bit of a scent just so y'all know ew i just said y'all oh that was so bad <laughs> 
All right, and that is all of the skincare products that has helped improve the texture of my skin so much. I definitely wish I had taken like before and after shots of my skin through this process, but when I started really amping up my skincare routine, I definitely didn't think I was going to be making a video about it. I hope this video has been helpful. Give this a thumbs up. Also give this a thumbs up if you want to see me make a video on my day and night skincare routine because there's definitely products that I didn't talk about that I use every single day. So, yes. Who make sure to subscribe. Yeah. All right, goodbye. Until next time. Bye. Okay, hello. I'm already like two minutes in and I haven't done the intro, so. Subscribe.